Hi you guys, welcome to Cancerian Chronicles. We are gonna go ahead and tap in and see what messages, uh oh, what messages we have for the sign of Cancer. So let's go ahead and let's get started. I kind of mixed my cards up a little bit. But we'll just figure it out. Okay, messages for the sign of Cancer. What does Cancer need to know at this time? Oh wow, right off the bat, we have um, the Seven of Wands and right underneath it, we have the Seven of Wands and then we have the Emperor. So I'm getting the sense of like someone is uh, fighting off or resisting um, some type of urges perhaps. Someone is trying to stay very controlled, calm, cool, and collected is what I'm hearing at this time. Um, for some people, this could be someone like in the background, um, someone that you would consider like a, an emperor, perhaps like a father figure, father of your child, something like that. And um, they're just kind of waiting and they're just kind of watching um, in the background. Um, for others of you, this is actually you and you are resisting the urge or you're holding yourself back um, for some particular reason. We have the Queen of Cups here. And this is, again, I'm still getting kind of the sense of control, which has to do with like controlling your emotions. Someone that's trying to um, like you're controlling your uh, your emotions. I'm looking at the fact that she's holding this cup, but she's kind of keeping it to herself. Um, so it's kind of like someone is holding a cup of love, but it's only for the most deserving, deserving person. Yeah, and in the meantime, we have seven of pentacles. Um, someone is letting, like kind of nurturing or um, doing, like they're growing, they're nurturing something um working on something in the background or something that they are have given birth to something that they're working on like you're just kind of watering your own garden so to speak um and uh we have justice which is about balance so someone is staying balanced uh again i'm hearing that calm cool and collected so this is um just what I'm getting. Someone is staying very balanced. Um, someone is keeping things under con under control. And at the bottom, we have the Nine of Pentacles. Again, this is like someone that's just like working on something just like on their own, right? Yeah. This is this just feels like someone who's working on building some type of empire, but on their own. Like they don't have any type of support or assistance. You're doing it on your own. And I'm hearing in secret. Some of you guys are working in secret. Something just flipped over here. Yeah, we have uh, vanity, which is what popped out. I'm getting the sense of like someone's not, we have faith at the bottom. So like someone is just trusting in um, that things are just going to kind of work out. Whoever you are, like you're not worried about how things are looking, how they look to other people. Um, you've kind of given up on, you know, not on other people, but giving up on worrying about what other people think about you. Yeah, someone is just enjoying their own company at this time or someone is just enjoying life in general. Like someone, um, I'm noticing the yellow, which makes me think about like confidence, right? Um, solar plexus, like someone is just really... Like you're building your confidence in something. Someone is building their confidence. We have guilt at the bottom. And it's like, number one, I'm feeling the sense of like someone has let go of any type of guilt that they used to feel um, with this energy of like taking care of self and enjoying oneself. But also I'm kind of getting the sense of like there might be some people in the background that um, like they're starting to feel guilty about something for some reason. We have dissipating and that was actually um, at the... Uh, bottom or the top I don't remember but I'm just kind of getting the sense of like um who it's, it's kind of like these people in the background like they're just kind of watching you I'm looking you know she's watching um tv and I'm just kind of looking at this person it's kind of like yeah someone is just like it feels like there's someone or some ones that are secretly watching you um they're watching you enjoy yourself and enjoy your life and again um someone like feels 
um, it's making them feel insecure. It's making someone feel a certain type of way about that for some reason. I don't know what it has to do with them. It could possibly be we have facade. It could possibly be because like someone else is like living their life um, or someone, some people are living their lives like it's some type of facade, right? And some people are kind of worried that, um, I don't know if these are people that you used to look up to and it's kind of like that facade is starting to dissipate, right? And it's kind of like also the happier you become, the more you start to take care of yourself, the more this is kind of like some people created some type of facade, some like some type of fake world or something like that. But it was based off of, um, I don't know, it's just really weird. It was based off of you not realizing something not realizing who you are not realizing your dreams or your goals or something to that effect and it's kind of like yeah we have creation it's like someone created some type of fantasy world and um you were looking up to this person it's starting to dissipate it's starting to disappear like whatever it was that you felt for this person or the way that you saw this person at the bottom we have bittersweet so the more that you start to realize this the more you start to come in your own into your own it is definitely bittersweet but you know that like this is for the best this is something that is for um your benefit and I'm getting the sense of like things are just about to get better for you. Unfortunately, it kind of feels like for the other person, things are going to get worse. But for you, it's going to get better. And, you know, I say this all the time, but I can't worry about the other person. Cancer, I'm worried about you. I'm worried about your happiness. <laughs> yeah. So it says the Holy Child star seed, right? It says, I am a divine child of the universe. And so someone is starting to realize this. I'm getting the sense of like somebody else already knew it. Destiny is at the bottom. Someone already knew that you had like a, a really big um, calling on your life, like your destiny. Someone already knew something about your destiny. And so they created some type of other fantasy or fantasy world or, you know, something that was like, it wasn't for your benefit. It was for their benefit. And whatever it is, it's starting to fade. Yeah, it's starting to fade. The happier you become, the more that this uh, this fantasy that they created is fading. And like, it's kind of like the, the scales are being balanced. Yeah. Okay, we have one flip over. The winged messengers. And it says uh, creation. So we have again, creation. Spiritual direction inspires my creative flow. Some of you guys are definitely like going with the flow. You're definitely working with the most high, um, with your guides, with your spiritual team, with your spiritual family um, is, you know, more like it. And the more that you're working and connecting with the spiritual family, um, things are just really starting to blossom and grow and bloom for you. Okay, what else for cancer? Okay, this one flipped and we have goddess of balance and it's right there by justice like isn't that ironic goddess of balance equality i create and foster reciprocal relationships i'm getting the sense of like okay so someone created some type of fantasy world some type of facade and what it did was it got you to kind of like um over give it's kind of like you were you were like you were living this life of like over giving, giving to other people, other people benefiting from you and benefiting from your energy. And all the while, whether you noticed it or not, like your um, your energy was dissipating, um, your happiness was dissipating. And unfortunately um, for you, you know, you were starting to lose a lot of your energy and happiness and fulfillment and getting further away from your destiny. But the other person was starting the more that that happened the more that this other person gained it's really weird um and so but this these are things that like someone had to do things of their own free will you had to give of your own free will so um now that you have learned some type of lesson about the law of reciprocity about how you know you should expect reciprocal relationships and not accept anything less um yeah 
that that's just kind of i'm just gonna leave it there so thank you guys for watching i hope that this message was helpful be sure to like comment subscribe share all of that good stuff i love you and have a beautiful day bye now Mwah.